The brewing dispute over an expensive piece of art after a little boy had a big accident. Watch as this five-year-old boy reaches for an art sculpture on display at a community center, toppling the piece and knocking the boy down too. The boy's mother, Sarah Goodman, stunned, but the real shock coming days later. They want to go climb on a five-year-old should be at the Please Touch Museum. So here in Philly, we have this museum. It's like for kids. It's called the Please Touch Museum. The kids can touch every. Any and everything, literally. That's that's what it's intended yeah. for. A museum like that, you better have that child in that stroller, hold their hand the entire time, and not even one of them little dog collars where where it has like the the uh, that stretches and they can walk off. Nope. Nah. You better have their hand the entire time. Hey, oh, oh, this is a good one. I like this one right here, man. I like that. This, be hype? I love bad kids. All right, play the oh, video damn. so we, so we can be hyped too. Kids. I ain't mean to spoil it like that. I'm sorry, YouTube. All right, parents of a five year old are being asked to pay a $132,000 bill after their son knocked over an art sculpture at Ooh. an art gallery. See, so dumbass. Ass mm -hmm. I'll be whooping for that ass. I know that's right. Yeah. Damn. Let's go. The brewing dispute over an expensive piece of art after a little boy had a big accident. Watch as this five-year-old boy reaches for an art sculpture on display at a community center, toppling the piece and knocking the boy down too. The boy's mother, Sarah Goodman, stunned, but the real shock coming days later. No one would ever expect to come into a place where kids are invited and have to worry about a $132,000 piece of art falling. The family receiving an eye-popping $132,000 claim from the city of Overland Park's insurance company. The fall allegedly damaging the piece beyond repair. The insurance letter reading in part, you're responsible for the supervision of a minor child. Your failure to monitor could be considered negligent. I was surprised, more so offended to be called negligent. City officials say the piece was secured. It's not an interactive piece. So when you have you know, somebody climbing on it, that's not what it's built for. The city says they hope the insurance company can work this out with the family. Crazy because CJ, weren't we just talking about this? I no, talking what, what children being about, unsupervised? About children effing stuff up and not listening to their parents, just doing what the hell they want. No, but wait a minute. No, <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Where was the parent? It's the a, parent was nowhere in first the scene. This the is scene. not the Please Touch Museum. You know what? If they want to go climb on a five year old, should be at the Please Touch Museum. So here in Philly, we have this museum. It's like for kids. It's called the Please Touch Museum. The kids can touch every, any and everything, literally. That's, that's what it's intended yeah. for. A museum like that? You better have that child in that stroller, hold their hand the entire time, and not even one of them little dog collars where, where it has like the, the uh, that stretches and they can walk off. Nope. Nah. You better have their hand the entire time. No. Nah, oh my goodness. I'm not. I'm not. I'm stop touching shit. At five, she, he should have been with her. It should have been no reason why that little boy should have been but climbing But I don't know, at, where was she? Because she was she nowhere was looking, in the shot. She, she was nowhere was, in the shot. She was looking at another piece of art somewhere. It says right here. The definition of negligent, failing to take proper care in doing something. Now, we could tell that she was of a certain culture, which is cool. But in our culture, I know our audience, y'all y'all heard this line before. <laughs> Don't go in here acting no damn fool. Right. You better stay by, right by here. If I if I got Look, to talk to you, you more than one time, you got to pinch that cheek I'm before you go inside. Talk to you one, more than one time. When we get outside, now my my mom didn't curse. She never cursed, so she would use all kind of wild lines. So hers was if if, if you go in here and you act a fool in here, I'm a tear fire to you behind. I don't know how you tear fire. I'm still trying to figure it out, but like I know exactly what that meant. So oh again, my gosh. My, she, I got that fire on me. She was negligent. You <laughs> failed to take proper care of your child, and he went and did something, and, and he went 
made a decision and broke something. Right. Because at you some point when he was even touching or about to touch no, the statue. He was climbing on the I know. All, that's what I'm saying. If she was standing right there, by the time he touched it, she should have been able to stop him from even climbing on it. But yeah. he done climbed on it. It done fell. And fell on top of him. But you, I guess what? If he would have got hurt, I bet they would have tried to sue. Yeah. But my whole thing is... Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, you know this is a art gallery. Right. So you know everything in here it's has expensive. some type of price or expense to it. Yeah. So even if he didn't knock that over, if he went over to one of the pictures and poked a hole in it, mm. if anything. Some of that stuff is priceless. He could have messed it up. He could have messed up anything in there. So it's like, you know the stuff is precious. Hold his damn hand. Right. And if he get too rambunctious, you take these little, get rid of this one and maybe this one. You take these three little fingers and on his little leg, you pop, pop, give him three little taps. <laughs> Straightened him right on up. Good. Yeah, right. You know they don't believe in that. Well, and that's why he, and that's why he suplexed that's that, that yeah. uh, 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 sculpture off yeah, the yeah, top that, rope. That built 132 style. Right. 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 So, so look, the first comment from Music says, yep, yeah, spoiled kids are expensive. Facts. Mm. Yes, sir. especially when you're not monitoring. Not just though. necessarily spoiled, but kids that don't have no, no, no uh, home training. Exactly, home training, like you know, just horrible. Just climbing just again. Climbing. Yeah, you, I'm pretty sure, audience, you've been somewhere, and you doing something, and you turn around, and all you see is this. Hmm. You yeah. know what that look means. Yeah, ain't gotta say nothing. Oh Lord, I'm about, I'm about to get my ass whooped. Mm -hmm. Hey y'all, let's show. That's all you got to do is that's, the look. Yeah, oh, that's it. Hey, look, hold on. Before I go to the next comment, man, I remember when my son was little, and we we was in the gallery. I forgot what store we was in, man. I think Macy's, and he was acting a fool. Mm. I look, man, I pushed that motherfucker between the rack. Laga, <laughs> 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 Straightening you right out, boy. <laughs> man. Well, you know, because every now and then, kids need medicine. Sometimes yes. you guys apply that medicine. Spare the Look, rise, some the of these parents do that. Like, oh my gosh. Sometimes, sometimes I can tell who's the parent in a relationship and it's not the parent. It's the kid. So next comment from Morningstar says, parent forgetting their responsibilities and accountability. Exactly. That's the I truth, wouldn't man. say they forgetting that. I just think that sometimes they just, they have their own way of parenting or, I mean... Like, perfect example, you know, some cultures, they let the children do what they want. It's, it's no structure. So yeah. when there's no structure, these kids feel as, okay, I can just do what I want. Yeah, without that, yeah, somewhere. There's no right. consequences. Yeah, all right. They don't have no consequences, so what's the point? Shit, I'm to, well, you see what You see what happened? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, $130,000 consequences bill. Mm -hmm. All right, so the next comment says from uh, Nellboy75. As my father would always say, look with your eyes, not with your hand. These mm. parents should be trying to install this in their kids. At five years old, that's a lot to ask, though. It, oh. I, 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 Because I'm just saying. I it, told you, stop, touch, stop touching shit. Yeah, but at, at that type, of, I would not have taken my five-year-old to that type of art gallery. Or honestly. an art gallery, period. Yeah. I'm not taking my kids somewhere yeah. where something expensive can yeah. be messed up. Yeah. Their children, at five he don't understand you at five he's not even supposed to be still that's what i'm saying he's like you know at around. five years old like here in philly you got all these you know children museums and uh, mm -hmm. uh different places that you could take them like it's been a while for me but i know for a fact there's a lot of places you could take these kids to where they can actually touch things and nothing if if something gets broke they expect for it to get broke yeah and also there's museums for adults to touch things too mm -hmm. <laughs> Saints oh, and Sinners. Please, <laughs> yeah, please touch me. <laughs> Look it up. Google Saints and Sinners. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. <laughs> he is stupid. <laughs> he is the best. Oh, God. He don't know what to do. <laughs> That's the platinum package. That's a platinum package right there, y'all. At the please touch me museum. Mm -hmm. The he's touch me. You know what I mean? The he's touch me museum. Mm -hmm. All right, so look, what they got next comment from last comment from Street. 
That mother has the lights on, but there's no one home. <laughs> yes, that's what delusion. Damn, why, why you come at her like that, Streets? I wonder what Dad said. That's why you ain't see Dad on camera. Because he was like, this mother. <laughs> why would she take Dylan to <laughs> goddamn museum? You know how bad that mother yeah. But wait a minute. Wait, did you peep the little brother to the side just looking like, <laughs> yeah. Like, you about to get your ass yeah, beat like, tonight. Oh, what is you doing? <laughs> <laughs> the little brother like, you doing too much. <laughs> 